So we've been following since four now. Brand new surveillance video showing the moment a Southwest plane skidded off a runway and into a ditch. The flight had taken off from Houston hours earlier. The skid occurred after the plane landed in Nashville. Eight people were hurt in that incident. Channel 2 Sarah Donchi is in studio now with a closer look at those scary moments. Scary certainly for the passengers and also the crew. It definitely is. It's scary to watch as an airline passenger myself. It is one of the busiest times to travel. And for more than the 100 people on board this plane last night, their trip did not go as planned. And for the first time, we are getting a look at what went wrong. Surveillance cameras were rolling when Southwest Flight 31 from Hobby Airport landed in Nashville Tuesday night. As it taxied down the runway, video shows the plane dip and the lights go out as it skidded into a ditch. We landed and we were taxiing in, and it, all of a sudden there was just a big boom, and it sounded like to me that a wheel blew out, but I don't know if a wheel blew out or if it, if it just collapsed or something like that. And then the next thing I know, we were in the ditch. Here the plane is again, this time in slow motion as it goes off the runway. You know, everything's normal, and then we hear this big pop. About two minutes later, emergency responders arrive on the runway and a crowd begins to gather outside the plane. None of the 131 passengers on the Boeing 737 were seriously hurt, but some were treated for bumps and bruises, according to the Nashville Fire Department. The general consensus with those passengers, by the way, is that this could have been much worse, so they are happy that everyone is okay. The FAA is now investigating this incident, trying to get to the bottom of what exactly, or why exactly, rather, that plane went off the runway. Lauren? All right, Sarah.